Divas and Divos, welcome to Roller Diva Dance Fit. I go by the name of Lady Godiva. I'm a fitness coach and skating enthusiast. And today, I'm coming at you with a funky little move that is a staple of roller dancing. That move is called the downtown. Okay, you want to take the train downtown with me? Great, then stand clear of the closing doors. And cue the music. Okay, party people, so we are gonna get down into the downtown. Before we begin though, I would like you to do me a fight ball and like this video. I would like you to subscribe to this channel and then we can go downtown, uptown, sideways, all the which ways and do all the things and have fun. Okay, sounds like a plan, great. Now, let's get into it. you to focus on your legs so with your legs I want your knees bent this is the same for every dance move that you'll do your knees need to be soft okay so by soft I mean they should look like this got it so perfect because we're gonna start out with practicing crossing one foot over the other you don't need to have them too far apart so have them fairly close so with bent legs you're gonna take your right foot, if you're right-handed, and put it over your left foot, okay? Now, you can put it over completely, or you can just put it toward the front. That's fine too, okay? Whichever one's more comfortable for you. This is really just for you to practice the movement that we're going to be doing in the down tap. So, put it in front, neutral. Back, neutral. Then take the left foot and do the same. Okay, so the left foot now goes over the right, over, neutral, under, neutral, okay? And when you're doing this, as with any dance, what I would suggest is so that you don't look too stiff and mechanical, you want to get a little bit of a bounce into it, okay? So notice what I'm doing here. Over, neutral, under, neutral, over, neutral, under, neutral, over, neutral, under, neutral. Under, neutral. See? See, but I'm adding a little bit of a bounce so it doesn't look as mechanical as it did before, okay? And then you can add a little bit more fire. Put a little bit more arms into it, okay? And this is a move by itself, right? Hi. Okay, so practice that. So now you practice that over under. You've gotten a little slip with it. Put a little bounce into it. You've got the arms going into it. Now we're ready to bloop, 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 level up to the next part of this downtown tutorial. So the next phase of this is you want to point your body northeast, right? So never eat soggy waffles, right? If you've learned that, northeast, southwest, you are going to be between never and eat, okay? Do eat, it's good for you. But for this, right between never and eat, okay? So what we want to do, instead of being static over neutral under neutral we're pointed sideways okay and I want you sideways to do over okay then you are gonna make a V with your feet and then you're gonna go under okay over V under neutral keep practicing so you want to drill that over V under neutral Southwest, okay? 
let me show you how you make that transition, okay? So you're doing soft knees, right, with a little bit of a bounce, doing over, V, under, neutral, pump, pump. Now you're taking this left foot, and you're doing the same thing, right? You're pivoting in the southwest direction by going over, V, under, and now the neutral is gonna be both feet in that direction, in the southwest direction, okay? And then again, pump, pump. This time with the left foot, pump, pump. And then you do it over again. Over, V, under, neutral, pump, pump. Okay, so that really doesn't look like the downtown you most likely want, right? That's not the one you know and love, right? Those are just the moves, the placement, the angling of your body. Now what you can do is play around with it, okay? And playing around with it, now we're trying to get more of a slide going in between movements. That is what's gonna convert you from that staccato, over, V, under, neutral, to a downtown, okay? So how do we get smoother? We want a teeny tiny bit of speed. And so you're gonna get speed by pushing your left leg back, or what you can do is take your right foot, right? If it's at a slight angle, you can actually push it, right? So that your left foot goes back. So push out kind of like this. Have the right foot sort of behind the left foot. It's diagonal and you're just pushing, right? to allow for that downtown movement. Okay, so let's start. Again, we're sliding. Slide, pump, pump, next direction. V, under, pump, pump, okay? So let's try that again. And this time, I want you to really soften your knees and dig into the ground as you're going one way and then the next way, okay? Because as you dig into the ground, it allows for your roll to be a little longer. So, now we're at this. We're pushing over the under pump, pump, right? But look at me digging in. See when I dig in, what happens? I roll a little bit longer, right? So that's why you wanna dig in. What? Dig in! What? Okay. Thank you. 
hard to find the one that really fits for you, but it does take practice to go on those stages. You're gonna be a little stiff and sticky at first. That's okay. You'll find your stride, dig in there, and keep it moving, okay? Wonderful. I'll see you next time. <laughs> I'll see you next time on Roller Diva Dance.